in our continuing series for um, the interviews from the 2024 Rancho Cucamonga Quakes Media Day. Patrick Copen dropped by to visit us. This is my first time meeting him. I know he finished the season with the Quakes last year. But this is my first time getting a chance to talk to him. Very nice guy. And um, there's a lot there. You know, he threw two really nice innings in that spring breakout game. So this is a guy to keep an eye on. Um, again, a 2023 draftee, right-handed pitcher. Um, Dodgers got a million of them, of course, a million right-handed pitchers, but, um, he might be a special one. So, um, anyone that the Dodgers really, you know, that they draft there, there is always a really good reason that they draft him. It's not just, oh, he just gets, he's got sparkling ERA or something. No, there, there's something extra inside these guys that the Dodgers want. So, um, Patrick might have something special. Very excited to watch him pitch this year. And so, without further ado, Patrick Copen. I have with me Patrick Copen. He was uh, kind of got on everyone's radar with the spring breakout game. Um, tell us a little bit about uh, your game and uh, how you felt about that spring breakout appearance. Um, I just go in and trying to be as confident as possible. Uh, you know, show, show off the stuff that I'm most confident with. And, you know, just... You know, be myself, try not to be anybody that I'm not, and have some have a whole bunch of fun with it. Now you didn't you end the season here last year? Correct. At Rancho? Okay, so you came you were you a college draftee? Yes. Okay. And then you spent how much time did you spend in Arizona? Um I spent about five five or six weeks in Arizona just building up my arm to be game ready. And uh I had a one inning outing in the AZL and then I came here to uh yeah, how about the team during the, the playoffs? During the stretch run. Okay, cool. And then uh, what college did you go to? I went to Marshall University. And um, did, how, how many years did you stay there? I was there for three years. For three years, okay. And then how did, now one of the things, of course, the Dodgers worry about is, you know, how much use is on the arm during the season. Um, so that's probably why the whole back to building up the arm. Right. Um, how, I mean, when did you end, when did your college season end versus when you started back in, in Arizona? Uh, we ended our college season the last weekend in May. Yeah. And um, I kind of kept throwing lightly just to keep my arm in, you know, in decent shape. Threw in some workouts for some teams and then um, I built up, like, probably the first day I got there, I started building up with, like, light catch and then quickly to uh, like long toss and bullpens and you know working on pitches that type of stuff okay so you're pro projected to be a starter is that correct correct yes all right do you know uh, which day you're gonna be starting yet the uh, opening day okay on this Friday yes sir right on so there you go at Lake Elsinore though folks so we'll get this out there quick and I'll try to, I'm gonna try to get out there too at least Saturday but yeah cool man well thanks Patrick appreciate yes, you absolutely man. thank you all right cool thanks a lot man thanks. appreciate it I want to thank you for watching the previous video. Um, if you have a membership, you are able to watch this video early. And so the memberships are cheap, and it just gives you maybe a 12 to 24 hour window to watch the video before everyone else can. Um, I want to give some preference to the members um, as we try to grow this channel in various ways. And so looking for different ways to grow it, looking for your ideas. So please feel free to reach out to us in any of the comments on ways we can improve the video. If you want to send an email directly to us, uh, dodgers2080 at gmail.com. And we appreciate all your feedback, all, your, all the followers, especially the members, and then um, also the people just come by the first time. So like, subscribe, turn on the notifications, all those good things. Thank you very much.